Hi there, it's Daniel at Safeway Car Sales. We spoke yesterday regarding the BMW M235i. When we spoke yesterday, I said that I'd send across a full condition video for you. Uh, so basically, as I walk around this car today, if there's anything whatsoever I think you need to know about this car, you will be shown during this video. Uh, we are very fussy here ourselves, so, uh, so hopefully nothing will be missed at all. Now, in regards to the car, I, I mentioned yesterday again, the guy who's owned this car has really, really, really looked after the car. It's a real credit uh, to his ownership of the vehicle. So to be honest, I don't think there's going to be much I can show you, but let's see so obviously it is a used vehicle uh, if you used to really look around it you might find the odd little stone chip uh, there's very minimal on there but obviously there will be some um, the lights aren't flickering that just does it on the video for some reason I'm stood next to the car they're not flickering at all all lovely on the body kit down at the bottom all nice and glossy not showing any signs of wear or anything which is nice it has got a slight tint on the front headlights as you can possibly just see looks really nice to be honest these wheels you'll see have got a very slight tint of gold to them um, very 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 slight uh, tint I must say uh, but you can see in some lights look grey lights got like a flick of gold in them which is quite nice Obviously there will be some surface rust on the brake desk just where it's been stood in our compound. All nice across the mirrors. Obviously very shiny and reflective on the paintwork. All the side blades and stickers are looking well. Tinted rear glass. It is an aftermarket tint, it's not the genuine BMW tint but as you can see they've been done very well no bubbles or anything like that in them as you could see good tyres all the way around very nice kind of as you can see looking down the sides no dents nothing like that it's good and shiny on the paint very slight tint on the rear lights just adds a little bit to it it's quite nice got uh, acrobatic tips on there an area where you usually get a lot of wear is on this back bumper bit just here going across little chip just there I'll zoom right in obviously we will touch that in but I do know it is there that's an area that's usually got a lot of scratches and scuffs on these because it's a flat panel the car stands really well as you can probably see here the kit the little extras that is done just makes it stand out from the crowd a little bit but there's nothing that's been done over the top which is good to see and the driver's side again all lovely and straight again good wheels all around there's no scuffs on it, any of these wheels Obviously all of our cars come fully valeted before they leave. But genuinely, just walking around the car, just to recap on the outside, as mentioned, if you really search for them, you are gonna find probably the odd little stone chip on there. Any car that hasn't got a stone chip on the front of this year has been painted. I'd be questioning why. But there's nothing that stands out whatsoever as you can see all nice across the bonnet on the window screen to show you to the insides now I'll start in the rear you can see the rear seats are absolutely lovely condition got the electric memory to the driver's seat area that usually gets a lot of wear is these bolsters as you can see it's all nice a couple of tiny little bits on it but obviously that is to be expected got some carbon wrap or carbon trim on the steering wheel just on the center console overall lovely car
hopefully that just affirms what I said yesterday a real credit to its former owner and again I must say I think them wheels look absolutely superb in this colour such a subtle hint so that's very nicely so there you go uh, if you need any further information please just let me know I'll be very happy to help you but for now thanks for your inquiry